Alright, in this geek tip, I'm going to show you how to perform a check disk on uh, on your hard drive in Windows 7. So, first thing we want to do is go to the start button. We'll go to computer. We're going to right click on the drive that we want to do a check disk on. We're going to click on properties. Let's go here to the tool tab. We have the check now button here for error checking. Gives us the options automatically fixing the file system error and scanning and for and attempting to recover bad sectors. When we select start, we are told that it can't perform it right now because the volume is locked and that would we like to schedule a disk check well that would be performed on the next boot so we don't want to schedule that right now because I want to show you another way to do it so let's close all this up and let's go down start menu all programs accessories command prompt we're going to right click on it and run as administrator. All right, let's bring that up a little bit larger. And we're going to run. The actual name of the program is chkdsk.exe, but we're going to run it without a, a user interface. We're just going to run it straight from a command prompt and these are the options we have a few extra options here but uh, we're going to accomplish the exact same thing uh, scheduling a disk repair just by doing chkdsk and we're going to do it on volume c c drive and we do a forward slash r for repair it's now telling us it cannot run because volume is in use and would we would like to schedule a uh, check disk on the next reboot. So, and we told it no. And that is the two ways to get check disk to run next time you boot in Windows 7. So, hope you get a chance and uh, don't have to use it, but it's nice to know how to perform a check disk from Windows 7. So, there you go.